Hi there, it's Andy from GM Car Sales here. Just going to do a short virtual test drive on the Peugeot 2000, uh, 208 GTI that we have in stock at the moment. Looking around the car, the car's in good condition and has received a full valet. Wee bits of tech in that on the car. So you've got your uh, electric front windows, electric mirrors, parking sensors front and rear. Just to show you there. Um, you've got automatic wipers, automatic headlights and cruise control. Dual zone climate control and air conditioning, which I'll stick on at the moment. I'll drop right down and let you know how well that's working. Uh, you've got an auxiliary port and a USB, uh, USB and auxiliary port. It's a six speed manual and it's absolutely stunning inside with the gloss black fading into the red and the half leather seats as well. Nice wee sporty steering wheel, it's got a nice feel as well, it's quite chunky and firm, not too soft. So what we'll do just now is I'm just going to go for a short drive and describe how the car feels to drive and let, let you know really all I can about the car. Second, into third, into fourth. The acceleration of the car feels really nice, very sharp uh, for the 1.6 litre turbo. Uh, that's producing 197 brake horsepower. The suspension is firm without being uncomfortable. Uh, you're not you're not hurting or anything like that when you're driving, but it's quite fun. A little bit of road noise, but again, if you've got the radio on, uh, that's that's not an issue at all. As I was saying, the car's got a good service history, uh, and it will receive a full RAC check from our technicians uh, to ensure the car is up to to a high standard. do here is I'll just go right round the roundabout, see the car handles, like you'd expect being a wee bit sporty, it is absolutely perfect, there's minimal body roll, it feels very planted even though the road conditions are quite greasy. What we'll do here is we'll come off, so about 25 miles an hour, into a 40 zone, something to third, into fourth that's is at 40. You can hear the rumble in the background, that's the new exhaust that has been uh, put on the car as well by our technicians. Sounds absolutely fantastic. And the visibility around the car as well, excellent. No, uh, no issues there at all. It's just so nice to drive this car. So what we're going to do here is we're going to take the next left. Now will take us onto the slip road, and we'll just go up to dual carriageway speeds, and just let you know really how the car's getting there and how it feels, and test the the cruise control as well. Lovely interior on this car again. Can't emphasize how nice it is with the so it's part leather on the on the dash here as well, uh, and the gloss red into the glossy uh, black as well, fading into it. It's just absolutely lovely, and it matches throughout the car as well. Everything really around your uh, dials on your dash as well as some red light as well. It's absolutely lovely. Coming joining here about 20 miles an hour to third at 30, fourth at 45, fifth at 60, and down at the sixth. It's so all through the gears, nice and smooth. Again, like I was saying, plenty of visibility to get out. 
So I'll test the cruise control here, so I'll pop it on. And it works going up the way. And down. And just turn it off, you can either press the pedals or the dewey button on the end. Just tap that and that turns it off as well. That's all in working order. Air conditioning as well, as I said I put it on earlier and it's now blowing cold air. So I'll turn that off and uh, turn it back up just because it's quite cold today. Uh, being in December. Coming down the gears as well, it's nice and smooth. No big lumps or chunks there. What we'll do here is we'll take the first exit off the Inveramon roundabout. And that'll take us into the Inveramon industrial estate where we're based. What I'll do in there is just try and best I can show a wee bit of a simulated town driving on a couple of the side roads there. Large pothole coming up, so let's be quiet and let you hear how suspension handles that. No knocking noises from the suspension there. Again, it's quite firm suspension, but again, it's not uncomfortable, um, so you can quite easily live with that. streets. This section road here is actually quite harsh, so it's quite a good test of the road noise on the car. You can hear a wee bit of road noise, a wee bit more than uh, on the rest of the roads, but actually, if, again, if, if you've got the radio on, you're not going to hear it. Uh, excessively loud or anything like that, so that's not a, that's not a worry at all there. It's quite a good section road I like to use for uh, talking about the handling of the car, just because there's a lot of wee bits that pop in and out, and again, like you'd expect. Uh, it's quite sporty steering on the car. It's very responsive. Um, best way to describe how it feels, uh, it, you really feel like the front wheels are planted uh, on the road. You can really feel everything you're doing through the steering wheel. Uh, all all the, the textures, I mean, you can sort of feel it in the steering wheel. Lovely exhaust sound as well. I absolutely love it. Take the next right here, up towards the branch. And we'll just head in here. that's us back to the branch. So I hope you enjoyed that short virtual test drive and if you'd like to get in contact with us uh, please give us a call on 01738 248080 or alternatively go online and visit our website at jmcarsales.co.uk. Thank you.